Okay, well, hello and welcome to another episode of Raven Rook Plays Fatal Frame 2 Crimson Butterfly. So I was worried I'd have to go on a bigger hiatus than this, um, but the folks at Video Games New York were able to repair my PS2 that I bought secondhand. Basically, there was a problem with the disc reader and then also a problem with the motor, and they expertly were able to repair both. Uh, if you're ever in the New York City area, I highly recommend that you go check them out. They have current gen stuff. They have retro stuff they have consoles they have japan imports they basically have everything and they're just wonderful repair technicians as well um super awesome and friendly too uh so just highly recommend it anyway i'm gonna let this kind of sit here until we get an opening cutscene which i believe would have probably been the promotional trailer for this game i never saw it before but it's actually it provides a lot of really crucial context that i think just is really worth a watch so i'm gonna cut to that once it starts playing oh i i guess i don't need to here we go Like, can you believe I just have found themselves trapped in a lost village? I've had this game since high school, and I've never seen this. This is just bananas. Like, it explains so much. Get ready. On the day of the ceremony, the village vanished. No. The ritual is fast approaching. God, I love these games so fucking much. God damn. years ago Down there. Thanks. Oh, look in there. God, the the composer 
for this track too. Just so good. Oh my god. Oh man. So like that you've got to believe that's promotional material like that must have been the trailer that they like you know announced wherever or pitched the game because like that was fucking beautiful that is 2003 motherfuckers that was beautiful god damn Jesus Christ okay we're gonna continue on that we're gonna get to right down to it so let's let's load the game and let's let's get on to to night three or chapter three so we did we did this part we saw this uh but we are going to just go through the door see the cutscene again because it did skip a little because of the issues that my ps2 was having so we'll see this cutscene uh without any problems knock on wood which was pretty creepy Oh yeah, our light goes out. That's not good. This game is hella dark. We need that shit. Well, that bodes well. All we have to guide us is some uh, intermittent lightning strikes. Creepy. All right, so what are what are we doing here? Oh, nope. How do I? Uh, no. There, circle, circle is how you do it. So, I'm also playing through Maiden of Blackwater right now, and uh, remembering the controls between the two games is a bit of a struggle, honestly. Oh, the Kusabi! This is something we should be worried about. Instant. The instant additional function. Detects fatal frame. Detects the fatal frame of the spirit and signals you by making the light in the upper part of the viewfinder flash red. A fatal frame is the most opportune moment to shoot within a shutter chance. If you capture a fatal frame, a shutter chance will occur during the blast back. Shooting again during the shutter chance creates a combo shot. All right. Ooh, we get a, a flash to uh, Mayu. Here we go. Where's she going? Where's she heading? Oh! Oh no! I guess we ran toward them. Must be in here. Okay, well, that was nice. Ah, keep doing that, okay. Kusabi's coming. There we go. Gotcha! What does that mean? The Kusabi has returned. Didn't quite. 
Okay, there we go. That's fine. You're done. You leave me the fuck alone. Okay, let's go find our sister. Oh god. Oh, there she is. Oh, nope. There. Okay. God damn. Yeah, the ghost keeps saying the Kusabi has returned, which... We'll learn more about what that signifies, but... Needless to say, it's not good. It's no bueno, y'all. All right. Okay, we'll use the radio. Marconi plays the mamba, listen to the radio. Am I right? Hey, why are all these red? Yai Kurosawa. Oh, I promised that to my sister, too. Okay, so we can see how Sai and Mayu are mirrors, and Yai and Mio, the character we play as, are also mirrors. It's a nice little mechanism. I'm just gonna, because we've already listened to these, but I don't like that they're highlighted as though we haven't. I don't know why. Uh-oh. Cutscene! <gasps> Whoa, that's a lot of dead bodies. <laughs> I'm willing to bet that's Sae, but what spectral figure is behind her? That was sufficiently creepy. Good job. Good job, game. Okay, we're gonna run. We'll come back for that shiny later. This usually signifies that we will die if we get touched by whatever spoopy ghost is coming after us. So we're just we're gonna cheese it. Yep, there we go. Okay, so <laughs> that right there was the Kusabi that everything has been warning us about. Okay, we do get a stone mirror, that's nice. That should help, hopefully. Actually, I, I think if I remember correctly, the stone mirror does not help us out with, um, okay, I missed it, that's fine. Uh, the stone mirror does not help us out if we get touched by the Kusabi. Which is kind of a drag, because at least in the first game, there's a mechanic like this uh, on the last boss battle with uh, What's-Her-Face. And if she touches you and you have a stone mirror, you at least get a second chance. But anyway, we're going to make a save, because there is a insta-death uh, at play. God, I'm so glad I get to be playing this again. I love these games. They, seriously, my favorite horror games ever. I was very distraught when my PS2 was crapping out on me. If nothing else, not just for my channel, but just, I love to play these games. On my own time, even.
For several days, earthquakes have increased in frequency at the same time crimson butterflies are swarming, sometimes blocking out the sun. What? Somehow, they look sad. Ha! That seems like we're anthropomorphizing. Villagers that see them put their hands together in prayer. The entire village has an air of impending doom. The village is quite fearful of the Earth's fury. Perhaps the Crimson Sacrifice ritual is performed to purify the ground. In the past, every area had some type of ground purifying ceremony. Many of those offered sacrifices to try to calm the gods. In that custom still, uh, if that custom still remains today, it explains the stillness in the village. The twin shrine maidens must be the guardian deities of this village. The guardian deities, the twin shrine maidens, have become crimson butterflies and are returning to the village. Well, neat. Obviously, everything worked out well. No. Oh. Okay. I don't like this. I don't like the flickering light. Why can't I go any further? Oh, I'm stuck. That would be why? Oh! Uh, what? She wanted to stay with her sister, obviously. Must have- must be a reference to Yai and Sai. Oh, good. Okay. I'm actually gonna use one, because our health- Oh, no, our health is full! Okay, never mind. For some reason, I thought we were missing health. Okay, so now we've got to find the handprints. I believe we have to go past the Kusabi again. Which, great. Wonderful. Obviously, we're going to make another save. Yeah, so, uh... If we remember... I'm blanking on his name. It's in my extra content video. Uh... But we had, Yai had help escaping, and actually this person is the reason that she ended up at Himuro Mansion for the events of the first game in the first place. Um, but he kind of helps her escape this fucked up scenario and trades it for another. So great, wonderful. Glad it all worked out. <laughs> But I love... Ooh. Wow. I did not love that. But I love how well connected everything is. It's just truly... just That's what makes it so haunting. Is the fact that no matter who you play as. No matter what characters are present. Everything is so inescapable. Okay, where is this bastard? Oh shit. Okay, run. Okay, where is it? Okay, it's right there. Great. Go! Go, you fucking idiot! Jesus fucking Christ! What? Do you have a death wish? It's because I was turned diagonally, but again, movement is just... Okay, I didn't get him, but he's there in the photo. I, at least I have a photo for my own... my own benefit. Yeah, I am missing health. What the fuck? Oh, oh, okay. I see. That's fine.
Let's um no, come on. Let's let's try going down here. Oh shit. Well, we did not want to do that. Okay, we got the blast lens. That's great. Yeah. Get out of here. Fuck you. Okay, diamond stack key. Forget what I do with that. Okay, there's nothing else. Oh, maybe I have to... Yeah, I bet. Okay, let me just heal real quick. And then I'm gonna... Yeah. Oh, what's this? Ooh. I have 19,000 points. Yeah, I should probably... No! Oh shit, the bed, Martha. Well, that's fine. There we go. It's not the end of the world. Note to self, I should really play this game at night. Okay, why though? That's supposed to be the one with the kusabi. Yeah, but I should really play this game at night, because there is just a massive glare on my television. Ooh, nice. Okay, good find. Okay, there's a lock engraved with the butterfly design. This is that great hall, right? The entrance. Yeah. Oh, shit. Nope. We are running. That is not okay. Go, ma'am. Ma'am! Ma'am! Really? Sometimes I think you want to die. Which, let me tell you, that's what you're going for. I'm sorry, I'm just not on board. I want to live.
Oh god damn it. I hate that thing. Those lightning strikes are a really cool effect, though. Like, really nice. Yeah, let's let's give it a quick save. Holy sh... Holy shit. Okay, so where... Where am I supposed to use this key, then? Maybe here? No. Oh, I bet there. Okay. Turns head. Yeah, you're turning heads. You go, boy. Okay, oh, nope, turn around. Here we go. Ooh. Subtitles were a huge quality of life improvement that were missing from the first game, and I'm glad they're here. If I take a picture of that place, ancient village records have been stored in the ceremony master's house. Many discuss the legends, folk tales, or rituals of the village. There are sure to be many records of folklore value. The forbidden ritual is also called the Crimson Sacrifice Ritual. Twins are used to help steal the gate to hell. There are two parts, the visible ceremony which occurs periodically, and if, if it fails, a hidden ceremony is performed. If all the ceremonies fail, the gate to hell will open, the dead will pour out, and the skies will go dark. They call this disaster the Repentance. Yeah, so not quite the repentance you heard about in Sunday school. Nope. This one is not a good thing. It actually wipes all God's village off the map. The whereabouts of Munakata's friends, the twin boys Itsuki and Mutsuki, are unknown, which is a little troubling. Oh yes, yeah, so Itsuki is, I believe, the one who helps us. Itsuki Tachibana. And he's friends with the Munakatas, who are instrumental to the first game and the Himuro Mansion and the Strangling Ritual. Yes, that's how Yae gets removed from this horrible scenario and placed into an equally horrible scenario later on. If they are found, I might be able to ask them about the village. Okay. Cool. That doesn't look good, but I guess we'll just ignore that for now. All right, we unlocked the door. Now what? Oh yay, creepy dolls. Of course. Always have to have to figure in somehow. Mayu! We found her! 
Finally. What happened? Someone was calling me, telling me to come back and perform the ritual again. The ritual? Uh, stay with me forever and ever. Mm -hmm. Of course, we promised. For now, let's get out of here. Chapter 4, Forbidden Ritual. So we are reunited with our sister. Butterfly Diary. Munakata and his teacher came to the village today. He said he was worried about Itsuki and came to help. But I can't tell outsiders about the village. So just, I, this is from my extra content video, so I feel like it's not really spoilery. Um, but Itsuki and Mutsuki also figure in to this ritual. Um, if you couldn't, surmise they're also twins so just draw whatever conclusions you may from that but i can't tell outsiders about the village itsuki's locked up in the storehouse i doubt he'll be allowed to talk with an outsider yay mr makabe made a picture of us with his picture box my face looks strange but it was interesting to see he's probably going to be blank because our cleansing isn't finished yet before that happens we have to help him escape if i can become one with you yai it'll be or i'll be happy that's the only thing that matters to me sai warp twins okay significant what do we see something shows in the photo it looks like the same doll There are dolls on display on a large doll stand. This must have been a girl's room. The dolls are falling to pieces now. Some of the dolls are even missing their heads. No way. Nice. Is she actually going to attack us? Because in a flickering room, that would be cliche. Oh, great. Okay, I guess that is happening. Oh, Lord. No. Yes! <laughs> that was so lucky. <laughs> You stupid idiot. Way to mess with the protagonist. You thought you'd leave unscathed. Wow. Wow, the audacity. Okay, okay, we get a map. And Folklore 6, the twin girls at the house gave me a map that show a door. They said that the hidden ceremony is near and I should escape out the side door before the, or during the night. They left so quickly I couldn't even ask them about it. The other people in the house are acting normally. Was there some ulterior motive behind the generous hospitality? Just to be safe, I will tell Munakata to go home ahead of me. Oh boy. Oh boy. Shut up, bitch! Okay. I really just want to get to a save point. Oh! No! Look, you're in the photograph. Just give it, just give it to me. Come on. I do my best. <laughs> I know it's not good enough. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, okay. Well. Well, let's go ahead and end it here. We learned a lot. We learned about the Kusabi, who is apparently coming. And it's not a good thing, because if he touches us, we die. Other than that, you know, as always, leave a like if you like it. It's like if you don't, come subscribe to what you got to do. But I'm hopping off, and we will pick up next time. Peace.